don't give a fuck. I don't, I don't give a fuck. Oh, no! Thank God. Oh, you bitch! What the fuck? What? What happened? What is going on? What is happening? Dude! <laughs> I was not expecting to come back in on this shit. You got him? What the fuck is that? <laughs> <laughs> I'm confused too, there. I'm scared. <laughs> I'm confused and scared. Welcome back to the Almond Brothers. <laughs> yeah, the, the Almond Brothers. <laughs> Um, that's, that's who does that though. Dude, this is like a speedrun tactic. You could probably skip to the end of the game doing this shit. <laughs> if I knew where to... Oh! Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Huh. Technically, it would be up that way. Can you dive? Interesting. Oh, okay. Are you back somewhere? Nope. Oh. <laughs> You're back at the aquarium. <laughs> <laughs> there it is. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well. Welcome back. That was like uh, people discovering new areas in Death Stranding right there. <laughs> <laughs> People did some out of bounds tricks. That's what that reminded me of. That was awesome. Can One. You... <laughs> I don't care. No, you can just go. It doesn't <laughs> okay. matter. Like it doesn't matter. <laughs> the only way I was able to get that done is I was grabbed by a uh, clicker right here, and I got pushed off because oh. of it. And I wonder if that's if you can replicate that. <laughs> I'm not. A I'm not asking you to, but that's funny. That's happened to me one time before, where like I fell through the map, um, and it was in that apartment building you were just in, like right outside where like the the safe was. Yeah, <clears throat> there was like that happened to me. Like I, I tried to open the door and then I just fell through the floor. For Why didn't you kill it? How'd you do that again? <laughs> you keep fucking shooting an arrow through the wind, like the window, without breaking it. How do you do that? So you're right, I think. Nope, not that right. The other way. Yeah, right there. They were breaking out the other window. <laughs> oh. Oh, you see its spooky eyes? They look cool. Yeah. Kill the ad! Kill the ad! Kill the ad! Ad block! Ad block! <laughs> oh, my good. All right. That was uh, it's already an exciting episode. Yeah, right. What the fuck? You okay? I was kind of putzing around in between episodes, like making sure that everything's recording properly. <laughs> and then, like, as soon as I and then as soon as I hit record, that shit happened. Oh, <laughs> We've had some good parts. I, I the the arm glitch was funny too. Yeah. Oh. A couple glitches in this game. You know, it's. My first time playing through it, I, I don't think I experienced any glitches until, like, really far into it. And it was just, like, a short little visual glitch, and then I'm like, oh. And then it fixed itself. You know, okay. it's because you're not a speedrunner like me, Taylor. You don't look for the, the broken pieces. Are you telling me that you did that glitch intentionally? I tried to, yeah. Definitely. <laughs> okay. I'm like, this has totally got, like, the making... Of a glitch area. How the fuck does the goddamn water meter have to run again? <laughs> because someone decided to poop. Tell your parents when I'm it's here. Not that I think it's. The tell your parents when I'm here. Sprinkler. Stop sprinkling the fucking toilet with their shit. Well, when it's the winter time, we won't have to worry about it running because the sprinklers won't be running in the winter. Or will they? They won't be. But what if this winter's especially harsh? In it's terms of, like, it's supposed to be really hot. <laughs> like, it's a really hot, like, this an 80-degree winter. winter. It's been especially cool. And the, the people will be like, yeah, global cooling, right? It takes a melted snowball out of a fridge and throws it at someone. 
I'll just take the fucking Trump like ways. Like it snowed, so therefore global warming isn't real. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, if I wanted to like glitch and like totally go out, I should have gone up. But I don't yeah, think I could go up. Probably not. I could probably go because I gotta get to that building. I probably could have like glitched it, swam all the way up until I landed into a loading zone or something. That's how people speedrun Sekiro. Is they glitch and they <laughs> glitch. Oh my god! Oh. <laughs> Good lord! That was an accident. <laughs> oh, my ass. Well, that's how people beat Sekiro, though. Yeah, is they glitch and then they just swim through nothingness until they, like, reach a fucking ending area or whatever. Get out of the way! Me first! Me first! I'm the one who told you about this path. This is a. This is a. <laughs> This is a pretty cool area too. I like it. Like all the you trash rushing water around. Like you know, it makes me have to pee. Do you have to pee? No. I'm saying that if I was Abby. Mm. No, this is not what I wanted. I didn't know it. I didn't know. I thought it was a drawer. What does he want now? <laughs> he just comes down just. And then closes the door. Got you guys some porn. <laughs> Since you guys like to be in the dark watching porn. You wouldn't be in the dark if my fucking lamp worked. Technically, we're not in the dark. Oh, wow. The light of the TV and the laptop. Yeah. This is really the only time in which we would ever play a game in the dark like this, anyway. Any other game doesn't deserve being played in the dark, unless it's a spooky. Artists, Aaron will trade up for flour, cigarettes, salt, canned fruit, toothpaste, paint, tampons, pads, any spices, cumin, oregano, red pepper, turmeric, cinnamon. So keep your eyes peeled. We can sure use the extra ammo from her. Yeah, his eyes are pretty peeled. I don't want to peel my eyes. No, it no. It doesn't sound very pleasant. You're telling me. The great Taylor masturbatory Batori yeah. does not want to peel his own eyes. Like <clears throat> like with a potato peeler. Yep. I got new glasses, if you notice. No. <laughs> <laughs> See? They look, they look I don't, they actually don't look exactly like my old ones. But they're, they're pretty close. But, you know. I thought maybe something was different. They're like hipster glasses. Gotta, gotta get hip with the hipster crowd. I don't know, I gotta work at like a fucking indie <laughs> coffee shop or something like that. Be like, yeah, I think Bob Dylan is overrated. <laughs> you know. Truth be told, I do think he's overrated. Do you? Yeah, I'm not a big you fan. Not, you do not like Bob Dylan? I, yeah, I'm, not a, I'm not a huge fan. I, 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 I can appreciate what he does, but I'm, I'm not, I don't like it very much. They call me Bobby Dylan. It's kind of like uh, the Lou Reed Metallica collaboration. Like, I can, I can, I don't even know if I can appreciate it, to be honest. <laughs> uh... Have you ever have you ever heard that? That that bubble? No, the no, the uh, I the Blue Reed Metallica crossover album. No, I'm not really a Metallica fan. I'm not either, but I'm just saying, like, you gotta check it out sometime because it's it's a fucking mind fuck. This is like Cause softcore you, porn mind Because they because they recorded it and they're like, yes, this is what we want to put <laughs> this out. This is what. It was all about guys, <laughs> and I think their magnum opus. I think they like they're actually like really proud of it too, which is the funny thing. Is it bad? Oh yeah, <laughs> but some people like it. Some people unironically like it, but it sounds like a fucking joke album. Like it's a troll album. Is what it sounds like because it's like really stock, generic sounding Metallica riffs and Lou Reed just like speaking like poetry over it. Yeah, I mean, maybe, maybe that's something they like. Maybe uh, they like. They're, they love it. They think it's awesome. <laughs> and it's. Like, I mean, they made it, so. Yeah. No, I know, but I'm like, you know, it's 
like they're proud of it. It's like, all right, cool. Like, you know, but don't be surprised when not a lot of people like your avant-garde metal poetry sh slam shit, you know. Like, they're just not real, <laughs> real fans of Metallica. I hate those people. There, there's been those people saying that stuff about the Midnight, like, if, if you don't like their new direction, you're not a true fan. And it's it's like, like, oh, fuck you, I can like whatever I <laughs> yeah, like. It's like, if I don't like it, then I don't fucking like it. <laughs> I still bought the fucking album, whatever. I gave them money yeah, I in the hope that they go back to being better. I could have just as easily have just listened to it on YouTube and been like, oh, this is a piece of shit, I'm not going to buy it, but I fucking spent money on it. Because you're, you're a fucking simp firm. Well, I mean, I do want to support them, but it turns out that the album they made is a piece of garbage. <laughs> the yeah. last album they put out was also a piece of garbage. Where? So far, they've got five albums, and only three of them are good. Where did you come from is what I want. Oh, yeah. Where did who come from? H him. Her? Like, him? It. Like, you I see, came down a hole. You see, you see, Billy, when a man loves a woman. When a man loves a woman. Billy, do you, do you remember... Do you remember the band uh, Pain of Salvation? Do you remember them? Barely. I know you only really like that disco song. I heard that the other day, and I'm like, that's a good fucking song. I like that song. Uh, they're, they're making a new record right now. They're putting out a new album. Is it more disco song? Uh, no. <clears throat> hmm. But it is more like electronic Shame. based, which is interesting. It's a, I haven't listened to much of it. I'm, I was never like a huge Pain of Salvation fan, but they got a couple good songs I like. I don't even remember what the name of that song I liked was. Disco Queen. Is that it? Yeah. Yeah. Maybe I'll have to listen to it again. Disco Queen. Let's disco. It's a good song. I like that song. I heard it the other day. I'm like, I like this song. It's a good song. What the fuck? The fuck? They put out another. They, they put out another. <laughs> <laughs> They put out another album a couple of years ago called In the Passing Light of Day. <laughs> how, does she, how does she manage to do that in the same way again? <laughs> yeah, the up. exact same rock. There's another one, yeah, In the Passing Light of Day. That was when the lead singer, Daniel Gildenlow. Hi, my name is Daniel Gildenlow. He's like the main guy behind uh, Pain of Salvation. Why are you going backwards? Well, because I can't go up that way. Yes, you can. <laughs> um, but... But Taylor, I broke my head last time. <laughs> Did you try the door right next to you? Doors are for pussies, Taylor. <laughs> Daniel Gildenlow, he's Swedish. Well, they're a Swedish band. He had a fucking flesh-eating disease. And he wrote an album like about his own mortality and stuff. <laughs> so he has this 15-minute long song called In the Passing Light of Day, and it's about him, like... Loving his him. own flesh. No, he, it's about him, like, you know, recollecting his life with his, his wife. It's, it's all right. I have to probably dig into that one a little bit more, but... It's interesting. It's different. And then Haken. You ever heard of Haken? No. They're well, who a, are these people? Too? They're a, a progressive metal band from the U.K., and they just put out a new album a couple weeks ago, ironically called Virus, which is kind of funny. They didn't call it Virus because of the coronavirus, but it just, just happened. So happened. I'm pretty sure I told you about this before. Yeah, but I remember you saying something like that. I don't know. It's pretty good. I like it. It's about a, about a dude turning into a cockroach. So it's uh, it's like uh, Franz Kafka's Metamorphosis, okay. if you're familiar with that. You know Tusk? Uh, that's the one where Justin Long turns into a walrus? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I know about it. I've never seen it, but I know about it. It's, uh, it's weird. That's, um, the fucking, the two girls, ah, uh, fuck, the two girls at the convenience store. That's, uh, Kevin Smith's daughter, Harley Quinn, and then, uh, Johnny Depp's daughter. I don't know what her fucking name is. Uh, Lily? Harley Quinn. <laughs> Harley, no, Li is that like Lily or something? I don't know, fuck, no, Lizzo. Whatever. But it, the, but the two, the two, um... Girls at the convenience store. That's the those are the characters that uh, yoga hosers centers around. Yeah, that's a terrible. Yes, but me and Melissa watched it. We had a good time. <laughs> Pass on the 
it is a bad movie, but I feel like Kevin Smith intentionally made it a bad movie. These are simple, different means to achieve them. Achieve my butthole, bitch. Did you just eat cheese? Ah! Did you just... Did you just eat a cheese ball? <coughs> you okay? Yeah, I'm just, you know, living my life. But you haven't answered me. That one, like, reverberated through the house. <laughs> yep. I did not eat a cheese ball, no. Oh, what'd you eat? I had the... Oh, the last three C? Yeah. Those are good. Yeah. I'm good for now. I am content. Don't need any more. I'm gonna wait, wait a little bit to have my other Mountain Dew, because I gotta fucking let some of this digest, you know? Cheer. Who? Who? It's the water meter! Get it! <laughs> <laughs> I'm not Lily. Yeah, I was just talking about fucking Lily... Lily Depp. Lily, Lily Singer. I don't think that's her name. I don't remember what her fucking name is. Anyone see them? <laughs> yeah, bitch. Ah, oh, fuck. <laughs> you, you couldn't have said that earlier? Excuse me, excuse me. Excuse me, excuse me, excuse me, excuse me, excuse me. Oops. Oh, I should have brought a gun to this knife fight. What the fuck? Oh, what's that? <laughs> <laughs> what a weird way to cut that. <laughs> Just die immediately. <laughs> it was such a weird melee kill. <laughs> it was, if it didn't have like any weight to it. <laughs> Alright, let's try this again. I've never seen that happen in this game. <laughs> That's so funny. Stay away, Lily. I'm not Lily. <laughs> Lily <can't> ah! <laughs> oh! ah! You're good. You actually fucking did something. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Shut the fucking monitor! <laughs> Got him. <laughs> right as you say, before we fucking did something, she's got a bomb shot to the fucking monitor. <laughs> oh, yeah, dude. Momentum. What the fuck you don't even know where you're throwing it. <laughs> I had to keep going. You can't. You can't <laughs> just stop. Yeah, but you ran into your own fucking bomb. Like, almost like knowingly, you ran into it. <laughs> Taylor, you can't just stop when you have momentum. It doesn't matter where the momentum is going. It just has to go. <laughs> yeah. Come on. <laughs> the blue. Who the fuck is move? Ah, my cleft lip! <laughs> I mean, I don't have a cleft lip. <laughs> now I do. Oh. I'm also dead. Ah! Oh. oh, hold on, hold on. Got this. What the fuck are you doing? Shoot an arrow! On my uterus. Do it, Wolf. I'm just one. Thousands. Do you have to do this? Like, just fucking no, shoot her in the face. You're going to hell. I'm ready. Oh, that's not where I want. <laughs> that was a very uh, 
A little very, over dramatic. Well, yeah, well, very painful death <laughs> for somebody who's just ready to die. <laughs> what the fuck do you want? I got it. Yeah. Yeah, I don't like me having all these fucking fights. <laughs> They called you Lily. <laughs> that means you're a girl. See? Just fucking said. That's why I just get confused. It's like the one person from Tiger King. It's a woman, but she identifies as a man. So yeah, fucking Carol Baskin. Everybody know. It's the one that loses her arm to a fucking tiger bite. I don't bite. fucking know who. <laughs> I don't, I've never watched it. Well, you should. You're missing out. I, I don't know if I really should yes, watch that. Yes, you fucking should. I feel like it'll make me dumber. That's the point, Billy. Oh, okay. It's dumb entertainment. They call me dumb tainment. It is pretty good. <laughs> like, yeah, it is. It does kind of devolve into that. Like, I wouldn't even say it devolves into it. It's just that it's so fucking stupid that it's like you can't look away, you know? It's that kind of thing. Ah, it's a dumpster fire. Yeah, it, it really is. It, it really, truly is. And that's what makes it great. But yeah, there was a person who worked at Joe Exotic's, um, like, zoo or whatever. And yeah, she's, uh... She's one-armed? She identifies as a man, or she, like... But she's not, like, trans or anything, as far as I'm aware. She um, just believes? Yeah, she just wants to be called he, you know? Which is, that's fine. But, like, she got her fucking arm bitten off by a goddamn tiger, and then she still fucking worked there. She didn't care that she lost her arm. Sorry, he. Yeah, come on, Taylor. Sorry. He didn't care that he lost his arm. Well, he is a stupid piece of shit. And he's like, I just I just love the animals. I'll just keep working with the animals. But you lost a fucking arm to one of them. Like I wouldn't I wouldn't be into that. How am I gonna wank now? I need two with the hands. Other. I need two hands. No, you don't. Nobody needs two hands. I was gonna say that. It's pretty cool. What's You're pretty cool. Like impressive. Awesome. What's oh, awesome? Pretty. And a little creepy. Protect them. No. No. <gasps> I wonder if your prophet had any idea what she was starting. She saved dozens of people. And Just days. dozens. Like half a dozen. Quarter dozen. Have you read her writings? Skimmed some. You'd benefit from it. Sure. Oh. oh we thought about that. If they thought about it, they would have made it so you can actually break it. Or, you know, have uh, have her say something about how I just threw a fucking brick at it. <laughs> but, you know, whatever. Fuck me. Oh, why did I make those things if I could have just... Ah, oh, it's bullshit. That's pretty dumb. <laughs> why can't I carry two more? I think there's an upgrade for it. I think you can carry two more if you get the upgrade. It's, uh, like, on the pills or whatever. It's like crafting more ammo. Mm. Improved melee weapon upgrade. Mm, this one of them. I think it might be the one over there. Craft yeah, one. Play. Yeah, it's the very last one. Yeah, craft more senior. So you craft more and you can hold more. Christ, that fucking water meter. <laughs> well, you guys <laughs> use a lot of fucking water. Apparently. Fuck. Jackson, Mississippi. You know what I hear about. Gonna hit myself, I'm so pretty. I'm too hot. Hot damn. For the police and a fireman, I'm too hot. Hot damn. I feel like that song is pretty good. I'm gonna eat this ass of a retired man. I'm too hot. Hot 
<laughs> my eyes are burning. Oh my god, too hot. Hot damn. Mark, Mark I'm Robinson. actually just a black woman. Break it down. Why are they all just hanging out up here? Just cuz? Yeah. Just cuz, cuz. Do they have any real reason to be up here other than just to be an obstacle for you to have to get through? Like, you know? Nope. Maybe they guarded, but that's about it. Mm -hmm. My dick's too hot. Ah, oh, damn. Ow! Ah, stings. Stings when I pee. It's attached to me. I can't stop the heat. Ow, oh, my breast! Oh! Oh! Oh, no! Okay. Give me that one. Oh! Oh, someone's doing something! <laughs> and then he stopped. <laughs> oh, good, you killed one. Congrats! Congrats! Yeah, you got it. Oh my god! <laughs> Jesus Christ! <laughs> I've never seen Lev do that before. Fuck! Give me that one. Give me that one. Oh no, he actually got it out of a fucking concrete wall. Give me that one. Well, I think you're getting them back. One. That's pretty good. It, That's only took, okay. it only took like a few hours for them to, like, oh. Oh, you could actually do something. Yeah. yeah. I'm running around at the speed of sound. Sounds very slow, apparently, in this universe. What? <laughs> the running around at the speed of sound. Yeah, if I'm running around at the speed of sound, then it sounds pretty slow in this universe. Yeah, right. The area, I'm the more, area is heavier. I'm more jogging around at the speed of a jog. Where are these cunts? I know there's more. I didn't finish going... Ah, oh, finally. Whoa. Whoa to you, oh, Earth, and fire heat by call. What's, it, what's that one? It stopped. The infernal ticking of the water has stopped. <laughs> <laughs> I'm fucking on the stereo. Click, click, boo. Lily, you lecherous whore. Oh, <laughs> sorry, um, my hand slipped. That's a lot. Of, that was a lot. That's a lot. Of <laughs> People. Yoink! Oh. <coughs> Ooh. <laughs> uh, yoink! Oh, they missed that one. Yep. Okay. I did. Oh, Jesus Christ! <laughs> you know, those are actually pretty good throws, dude. <laughs> Both of them. <laughs> oh my God! <laughs> Oh, you're gonna Billy, just turn on the fucking lead switch over here. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> oh, too hard. Oh. oh, well. You can only turn it on for like five seconds at a time. <laughs> oh. Hey, bitch. I wish you could have hit him in the face. Yeah, me too. That's the one thing I want with this fucking weapon, is hitting him in the face. Yeah, give me a face shot. I don't think they ever do it, but... Am I finished? That's actually, like, half the reason sometimes I don't use certain, like, melee weapons and things, is because I don't like the way in which they kill them. Yeah, it's always the same fucker. Give me that. That's more brute. 
Yeah. Well, well like the machetes too. You always hit them like in the like hip. Yeah. Fuck these scars. Uh, seraphim. Is that what remains of it? Oh, potato <laughs> chips. Ooh, piece of candy. Ooh, piece of candy. <laughs> I could probably look around, but I'm not going to. I don't think there's much to find. Probably a couple more like candies, but that's about it. You go at your own pace, boy. You go your own pace. Like if you do the hammer thing, you should like be able to like disembowel them. Yeah. You know. But it's just kind of like... Or like bludgeon them to death with the, the blunt end of it. <laughs> right? Right? I blunt guess. End of yeah, it. I guess so. <laughs> I did a weed hand sign. <laughs> Alright, well next time at Chinsdo Chaps, we get high. Hmm.